So after being killed by Phantom Ornstein, we've made the executive decision that Chicho is going to go conquer a couple of other things before he completes this area. So you want me to go ahead and take that shortcut I opened up earlier? Uh, yeah. Remember yep. those giant? Yeah, those giant doors you opened up. Yep, yep. That's where you went. I know exactly where to go. Let me try what that other guy tried. No. <laughs> Well, no matter. He's dead. It doesn't matter. <laughs> so thank you, Mylan Poa. You you were a good man, and you fought the invader. And we should probably message you. Indeed. I <laughs> can't land a backstab. Especially from the front. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that guy was my hero. Yeah, guys who do that, not to toot my own horn, since I mentioned doing that a bunch before, guys who do cosplay builds are generally really, really good. Because, no, otherwise. Yeah, right. Um, yeah, they're generally really, really good, because cosplay builds are kind of forced to use typically very bad equipment for a long time. Mm -hmm. You want to be accurate? No, you're not going that way. Oh. You're going down there. Right. And then out the doors. And you should just run. Don't fight anybody. Because why would why would you do that? You just you just run it. Because I'm Dwayne the Bandit. Run forward. Yes, I'm aware of this, Woody. Run. Since I took them off. So you have to go all the way back through Sen's Fortress. Oh. Really? Yes. Like from the top down. Well remember you have the shortcut you unlocked with the cages. Yes. So, I'm going to offer you a couple of spots where there's some stuff to do now that you have not yet completed. Like? You don't, you don't need to mess with us at all. Oh, indeed. Just straight. Indeed, Woody. <laughs> okay, so your options are here. You can explore the forest a bit more. There's a major boss in the forest you haven't fought yet. You're about the right level for that. Is it the forest where, like, I fought the big butterfly? Yeah. Okay. Kind of that thing. Um, there's that big ol' Hydra in the lake. Mmm. By Havel. Havel. You're at the right level to fight him. There is the un the boss in the Undead Parish. Remember the giant demon guy? Um. Oh. Real long time ago. Remember the, you could the go one, back? He, lo he looked like the looked dude, like the first, first boss, boss yeah. and then he totally just pulled one over on me yeah. multiple times. Yeah. There's that guy that you could go fight. I kind of want to fight the Hydra. Okay. And the final thing you can go and check out, which would be the most beneficial. Why don't you go ahead and go save the bonfire in there, just in case. Okay. <laughs> just in case you die, you don't have to make this whole run again. That uh, could potentially be good. It's the hardest area that you'd have access to right now. But with a little intelligent planning, you might get through it. And that is the area with the ghosts from the very start of the game. But I don't have the holy item to kill them indefinitely. No, that's not what that you need for that. Oh. You can kill ghosts. You just need to use... There's a little item you have, and you actually have a couple of them, that you can use to temporarily be able to harm ghosts. Huh. And you can go into that area. And now, what that area holds is the final tier of sword upgrades. Oh, man. The final ember that you can use to empower your sword to plus 15. Mm -hmm. And now to get to plus 15, you need a Titanite Slab, which is the rarest form of upgrade material. And you know what drops a Titanite Slab? Slabby people? The Asylum Demon guy. So if I do want to fight him, I really do need to just go into that evil wicked place first? No. That's not what I said at all. Well, no, no, because, yeah, I guess it doesn't matter whether I pick up the, yeah. the slabs first. You need or both. The, yeah, so. I need both. So either way. Well, for, honestly, I want to fight the Hydra first. Okay. Thank you, bloody-handed, brain-head, flying things. Evil monkeys? Yeah. Go ahead down to the blacksmith. It's been so long since I've been in Sense Fortress. That's not the right way so long and you have such a poor sense of direction. <laughs> Leave me alone. 
Well, at least you have some decent gear now, too. The Silver Knight Shield you have is good. Good. And you should keep that. That's actually a semi-rare drop, so you're kind of lucky that you got that. I've farmed Silver Knights for hours and not gotten that before. Really? I'm kind of mad. <laughs> Dark Souls likes me. Well, it's one of those things where it's like, if you want a random drop for a certain character, it's always the case of you get it on the character you don't want it for, and you don't get it on the character that you do want it for. <laughs> Murphy's Law. It's not Murphy's Law. Uh, well... Uh, okay. <laughs> Some aspect of it kind of feels like, because Murphy's Law is like, whatever does go wrong will go wrong, so you're thinking, oh, of course I should get it for this build. I'm gonna die if I keep talking, so never mind. You know what? Estus? Yeah. Maybe I should just take care of him. I could do... I could take care of him fast. Yeah, your guy's pretty powerful, so... Darn shocked hearts. <laughs> the bastard cousin of sweet hearts. <laughs> they are a real thing, you know. They are? Yeah. What are they? The they're, sweet tarts they're, with sour? Yeah. Well, that's dumb. You didn't know that? No. Man, what's up with me? I'm not as much of a candy aficionado as you are. Doesn't your guy look cool right now? Yeah. Except for I got a snake chasing me. Uh, and I can't sit down. Oh, yeah, I can. Bye. <laughs> okay. Um, Maybe bye. repair your stuff with the blacksmith, just in case. Okay. Actually, you just did that recently. Well, <laughs> not recently for us, but... How do you remember all this, Woody? Well, I don't know what because I edit all our videos. <laughs> right. Okay. Repair equipment. Mm-hmm. And... Mm-hmm. Now, should I go ahead and change back to the other shield I was using? No. Okay. You really not. You really don't need that, and you're honestly, like... I'll put it like this. You're not really conserving stamina well enough, even with it, so... It's kind of like you might as well take the thing that blocks more damage. Thanks. <laughs> Okay. I'll, I'll rephrase that in a positive way. You're not using it to its fullest extent, so it would make better sense to use a shield that more fits your strategic profile. Well, thank you, Woody. See, doesn't that sound nicer? It, it sounds pretty darn but you nice. you one-shot at that guy. See how much uh, more powerful you've gotten? Yes. Go right. Just want to go for the hydra, right? Woody, I know where I'm going. I don't need. No, you don't. I don't need to stop and ask her directions. I know exactly where I am. Yeah, you know, it feels pretty good coming back to an area. Yeah, and, and being all taken out of the guys. Man. Yeah, just be like, oh hey, yeah, it's me. I'm back. <laughs> With the vengeance. Dwayne's here. Dwayne's here to kick some ass. And you might as well just go. The closest um, bonfire to your hydra is going to be the one down in the cliff by the night. Remember that? Yes. Alright. I can just drop down right here. On top of that guy. And it's not where it is at all. Right. There, you're the opposite way that you're going. That way. But is bonfire back here? Yes. Where the, I thought it was in the cave. Where's it the is cave? in the cave. Where's the cave? It, it's ah. in the corner. Right. See, now you're remembering it. Yeah. Well, see, I thought I was already on this level, so that's why I was all confused. Woody. Now, do I want to... Oh, wait, no, I didn't collect my souls from that last thing, so never mind, I can't level up. 